Good morning, Matt. How are you? Good. How are you, Tom? I'm great. Thank you. So where are we? We are at 2730 Robin Street in Main Endwell, Endwell, New York. Uh, Main Endwell School Districts. This is a three bedroom, one bath, uh, quiet street, nice neighborhood, lots of kids, lots of families. And why don't you get a bunch of show? It looks like this is brand new in here. This is all brand new. This whole house has been redone. Oh, great. He ripped up the carpet and found the original hardwood floors. He put nice. all the tiles in. He redid the kitchen and the bathroom upstairs. So what's the room beyond this? Is this is so th this is living room. This is the living room. We have a dining room off of here, and then this is a sunroom that was added some point after it was built. It was built in 1940. Um, an IBM engineer lived here and built this sunroom. And originally there was a side entrance door huh. right here. So you can use it as a sunroom or, or an office or a small den. Hideaway. Yeah, exactly. Now, uh, um, all replacement windows? All new windows throughout. <clears throat> and clearly fresh paint? Fresh paint. Mm -hmm. And we have the dining room here, and then we have a back door that leads out to the deck. This is a big, nice space. Big space. We have 1,250 square feet and three bedrooms upstairs. Okay. So we got a nice covered deck out here, and that's all our yard out back? Covered deck, yard, and then off-street parking that pulls you out back. Mm -hmm. um, there isn't a garage, per se, but you can pull and get, uh, get coverage underneath. Well, it was a garage? I think point? at one point it was, and yeah. then it was kind of partially finished. Made more into a, a den. So yeah, it's more in like the man cave or a den. Well, we're going to see that, but let's take a look at this kitchen. <coughs> Brand away. new kitchen. Like everyone else in America who's watching HGTV with the uh, fixer-upper shows, <laughs> this is basically an HGTV quality fixer-upper. Nice. Quality work all throughout. Brand new, brand new kitchen. I love the backsplash. Backsplash is great. It's a stone backsplash, and it's right in line with everything that's popular today. And the nice white cabinets also are great because white it's cabinets. very neutral. Yep. And there is a uh, pantry here, deep okay. pantry, and all the closets nice. upstairs are walk-in closets. Updated lighting, modern, everything, all, all modern finishes. Nice fixtures all the way through. Brush, the brushed uh, steel look. Mm -hmm. So let's go take a look at the bedrooms. Okay. Wow. Yeah, so this is a three bedroom, one bath. This is the only bath, but it's been all redone and it's all new, uh, all new tile work. I love the new glossy vanity. finish, don't you? Yeah, it's Isn't a beautiful nice? finish. And this looks like a laundry, laundry shoot. shoot. Oh, I love it. That's great, all the way down to the basement. Yep, you're gonna see a lot of the character of this, this house. This is definitely, all the bedrooms have a large walk-in closet and then the, there's one bedroom that has attic access. So we got a ceiling fan here. A ceiling fan here, uh, it's forced hot air heating and you'll have to get window units if you want AC. First two, the bigger bedrooms have walk-in closets. This bedroom has attic access, tons of storage up there. Oh, it's a, it looks like it's all finished. And it is a finished attic. So someone could actually, if they wanted to, you there's could, windows. You could possibly turn that into living space, absolutely. Oh, okay, great, wonderful. And I like the, I like the, I like the fact that they put fans everywhere. Because like you said, yeah. you know, you, you don't like, you can probably live without the air conditioning. Yeah, with all new features and it does stay cool back here. There's a lot of trees, so sure. it stays cool back here. And, and that's one of the large closets oh. and you can walk all the way in there. It goes all it's the way nice, behind the wall. nice and deep, goes along the wall. Yeah. And the bath access is there too. Very mm -hmm. convenient, very smart. For the plumbing, yeah. 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 Okay, and then you've got um, another bedroom with the same idea of a big closet. Stand. Built-in bookshelf here. This is a little bit smaller. That's obviously the master bed. This is the second bedroom. And then another large walk-in closet another here. Another good-sized closet, yeah. Yeah. And that goes all the way along the wall. Either way. Okay. Okay, we're in the basement. Off Surprise! The kitchen. Yeah, Surprise. exactly, right? This is all, yeah. all, new, all new space. New carpeting throughout. He repainted everything. Now, this is where a garage would be, but basically, this is just finished space you can use for a lower den, mm. family room, playroom, man cave, uh, theater. I'd put a theater bat down here. And, well, that would be nice. And you also, as we walk around the corner, you got nice sliding glass doors out to that covered area, which could be a carport yep. then. And this is all retiled here, too. And that's that's perfect spot for it because it's not wide enough for a car to pull in, mm -hmm. but it's covered. So now you have a covered carport with the off-street parking. Yeah, I, that's kind of neat. It's in the, the property. It's got a nice lot, a great mm -hmm. lot, and it's all. It, there's a gate fence at the end of the driveway, and all. Yes. Yeah. That's fenced off. You can open that up if you want to use the off-street parking down to the back, or keep that gate and just pull up to the gate. And you've got nice trees back here. Nice property. This is a great. Redone. That's the beauty of it. Yeah, like I yeah. said, HGTV. It's a it's a fixer upper, and it's been fixed. It's been fixed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, exactly. Matt. Thanks for showing it to sure us. Sure thing.